All right. Oh, are we on? Yeah, we're going to get started. Anthem versus Zadik. Yep. Looks like Captain Falcon versus Pikachu. These two are old school Michigan Melee and Brawl players. Uh, Anther, he's joined the scene, well, he rejoined the scene from his long hiatus about two or three months ago. And he's still as good as he ever was. Yeah, man. He was, we were talking actually yesterday as the, the event was winding down. We had a nice little co good conversation regarding, um, you know, just what he loves. He actually, you know, he had this really interesting conversation with Samurai Panda, and he just told me, he said, listen, guys, I miss, I miss Smash. I, yeah. I want, I'm coming back, you know. And it's going to be something really great. And it's, you know, I love Anther. I, I met him at Apex. No, I actually met him at uh, CLT. But is this the match? Oh, oh wow. We're going to get started right, right now. Into it. Okay. So Pikachu Falcon on FD. Oh, no. Wait. Nope. Maybe this is just a button check. <coughs> I hope so. I really think Zadok should be banning this stage. Yeah, definitely especially for with that Pikachu. chain grab. Yeah. Yeah. And if you don't know what that chain grab is. Oh, wow. Actually, it oh. looks like they are going into it. Okay. So Pikachu has an up throw chain grab on most of the, oh, I think all of the fast fallers on the stage. And it can usually go to death. But it looks like Zadok is comfortable here. So we'll see how it plays out. Yeah. Zadok must know exactly what he's doing to go on this stage. And right now he's just getting some combos in, trying to get him off that stage, trying to go for either a knee or probably a back air. Oh, I, okay. So Zadok is opting more to try and knee him off stage, but if he gets caught by an up air, he'll probably lose his stock. Yeah. So it's, he's kind of playing with fire there. But it's, it's relatively even. It is right now, and right now, like, it's pretty much even percent. Let's see if he gets a nice back. No, I think that was an up there right there. It, yep. And it's funny, because I, I was talking to Zadok earlier today, and he wasn't comfortable, like, he wasn't too confident in this match. <laughs> but he's doing really well. Zadok takes the first stock. Yeah, very well right there. Nice. Oh, knee. I think he lost his jump. Yep, and yep, that's the first done. stock. All right, now we're back to even percents, obviously. Zero, zero, three stocks apiece. And right now, we're going to be waiting. There's going to be. Trying to space each other out, trying to get a really good move. Yeah. Nice and attack and there. Anther needs to get grabs. Like, I mean, even though it is kind of cheesy, like, it's, a f it's free damage, and it, Zadik is going in. Yeah, getting a rapid boost right there into an up air, trying to get some percent, so when he gets that knee, he goes right to death. Oh, man. Uh oh. Anther's in trouble here. It's interesting. Anther was here um, very early, just practicing. So let's yeah. see if that practice pays off. Oh no, he lost his jump. Anther caught him out of his jump. So that's the second stat. Alright, wow. Anther not even having to get any chain grabs. It's a very nice play right now. I like the way he nares into people. Like he's so comfortable doing it. Even though like if they just miss like mess up his spacing, he can take a lot of percent off of that. But he's so confident when he does it that it usually works. Okay, let's see what Zadik can make off of this. Not much. Yeah, he's gotta he get something some going. So I think this is a really momentum-based match matchup. Once Falcon gets a hit, he can just juggle Pikachu across the stage. But oh my gosh, he did not. Oh, that, that would right. not have been good if he was able to get him like down air him off. Yeah, that or stage. something just hit him. Yeah, uh oh, this looks bad. Anther isn't utilizing these grabs at all. He's not, and he's still in the he's lead. He's doing yeah, very he's well. Really, yeah. Uh oh. Mm, all right, that's nice second stock. Zadok's not too far behind. Only 63%. He can still make it up. Uh oh, but he can't be off stage though. No, and if you get that, there oh you go. Gosh, beautiful Styling string now. right there. Oh, and the oh, his quick attack knocked him out of his up B, and he kind of got flubbed there. This move, Anther's movement is so fluid. It's just looking very beautiful right now. And you can tell, like, that warm-up is really paying off. It is. Zadik coming a little late, not exactly getting all the practice he needs yeah. to get going. And this is losers, so once you're out, you're out. Yep, once you're out, you're out. Uh-oh, here we go. Putting him on the Wheel of Fortune. Uh-oh. That's it. There it is. That should be the second. Oh, he oh, lived. Beautiful okay. DI there by Anther right now. Oh, no. He can't get it off of that. <coughs> That Nair is so powerful. It's just so disruptive. Oh, he knocked him back towards the stage. I think he tried to use the tip of it to knock him further away. Yeah, he was trying to use that uh, just, oh, the destroyed hitbox, right? Yeah. All right, that's the third stock. So Zadik's down quite a bit here. He needs to play safe because Pikachu can knock him off stage and kill him very easily at this percent. Or he can probably even up smash him and he might die. 
Oh, yep, that's there it. it. Alright, game one goes to Anther. Definitely. Very good move by Anther. Take him out there. Now, right now, we got to see where Zadok actually takes him. I think he's, you know, if he takes him to Battlefield, he will have some ledges to work with. Yeah. But I, I think he might choose PS1, actually. I would actually take him oh, to Dreamland. Oh, it looks like he's going to Dreamland. Yeah. Dreamland's a really good Falcon stage. He's able to, like, recover uh, a lot better. Oh, no. He wants to go to Yoshi's. He wants the quick kills. Okay. That's another good stage. And let's see what, uh, oh, no. Anther's got to grab. Oh, okay. Good recovery. These up airs. Oh, the down airs. Oh, oh an and SD. SD not helping him right now. All right, let's see if Zaddy can bring this back. Oh, good spot dodge there. Very good. Okay, he's making some risky plays here with his side B and down B options. Yeah, and I see what Zaddy's doing. He's just trying to get him propped up there with a nice couple of down airs, but he's just not getting anything. Nanther's just reading him right now. Yeah. And now that he knows he has a solid, comfortable lead with that suicide, I don't think he's going to make any like risky plays. Oh, no. That's it. Yeah, it's not looking good. I think this might be a physatic, but he can come back. Falcon has that ability to like punish very hard. Yeah. But he needs to space better. Like Falcon, he just needs to play like Runaway and just find his opportunities. But like Anther is all over him. Oh, what was that? Anther just... Okay. <laughs> Channeling his inner 2006 right now. Right. Beautiful. Watch out, Axe. Oh my gosh. The thunder. Uh oh. Panther has a pretty solid lead now. I think he's just feeling himself at this point. But Yoshi's comes into play. That, that's another good thing about it. Even though Zadig is behind, these small blast zones off the side, they will allow. They can allow Zadig to come back. But not if he can, keeps getting gipped like that. No, it's not going to benefit him. He's going to have a lot of trouble if he doesn't get these next three stocks quickly. Yeah. Uh oh, he is. Oh my gosh, he's up air. He's all over Zadig. Uh oh. He's not reading him as well as I thought he would. He just seemed, yeah, he's just getting juggled right now. Yeah, Anther's tech chase is really good. He's keeping yeah, Zadik it's on very impressive, speed. actually. Uh oh, that might be it. I think that is it. No, oh, Anther, right, let him back ledge. on. Oh no, that might not be good. But All Anther right. just showing he just uh, doesn't care right now. He's so good. Anther's so good. He's just all over the place. Pikachu's such a small character, like. And th th I think the real thing, the real reason Pikachu flourishes is it's just because like he can anti-aerial people so well. So jumping usually isn't a good idea if you want to. You can't jump at Pikachu if he's jumping as well. Uh oh, okay, Anther. Okay, okay Anther. Yeah. All right, Feeling so himself. Anther advances into the bracket. Yep. And a great job here by Zadik. 